Hi, I'm Dr. Allison Wiemann. I'm an associate professor in the School of Psychology, and my research focuses on understanding how the ways that we think and behave can cause problems with anxiety. Right now, many of us are experiencing new and intense stressors from the COVID-19 pandemic, including trying to work from home while parenting, needing to maintain physical distance from our friends and family, caring for sick or otherwise vulnerable loved ones, and trying to make sense of changing public health recommendations. Although this has likely increased anxiety at least a little bit, some of us are experiencing high levels of anxiety that impair our functioning. And this is where our thoughts and our actions become really important, according to lots of research, including some of the work that my students and I do. So when people make really negative predictions, for example, that they'll get really ill or that they won't be able to handle physical distancing, they also experience higher levels of anxiety. To try to feel safer, they may do things like avoid going outside, even for walks, which actually ends up making them feel even more anxious. Alternatively, when people set really high expectations for themselves, like they need to homeschool their children five hours a day while working a full-time job and making healthy meals from scratch, they also experience higher levels of anxiety. To reduce that anxiety, they may do things like work well into the night, which actually leaves them more vulnerable to anxiety the next day. So our research can help during the pandemic by providing people with ways to change their thoughts and actions to actually bring some of that anxiety down. Thank you.